Hey guys, welcome to this week's WTF. We are testing out a new product that launched for fall 2017 from Dior. It is something metallic, which I like shiny things. So um, anything metallic usually makes me really happy, especially when it has to do with the eyes. But this is a little bit of a different product. It is marketed as a metallic eye and lip product. So I've never seen anything that was actually like on the tube says eyes and lips. We're gonna figure it out together. It comes in seven shades. I thought I bought them all, but apparently I didn't. I have six shades, so I'm gonna be swatching them for you guys. And of course, wearing on my eyes and lips today this product and seeing throughout the day how long wear this product truly is. It's 25 bucks, so not crazy expensive, especially for Dior, but I did spend a lot of money because I bought six of them. So I haven't even swatched this on the back of my hand. I figured we would just do that together. So let me just open all of these up right now so we can take a look at the shades. Ooh, I mean, that'd be pretty on the eyes. I don't know that I would put that on my lips. Like a brown shade. This is more of a pink shade. Come on, I hope there's like a red. Come on, red, come on, red. Okay, no, it's not red but I think this is probably what I will use on my lips. Let's just do a quick swatch. So it says that these are fast drying, which kind of concerns me because whenever you're working with a cream and it's fast drying, that means you gotta move. Like you can't just like laugh, talk, play, like you gotta like get in there and blend things out because usually what it means is once it dries, it's not going anywhere. So that can be a great thing. You just gotta, you know, work it fast. That looks gross actually. Is it just me or is that not very metallic? Let's try the pink one. Oh, that's much more metallic. Whoa, she's pretty. There's a bronzy one. Again, not very metallic, like a little bit of a sheen in there. There's a more silver toned one. Those two look kind of similar. I mean, this is a little bit lighter. That's really pretty. Okay, I like that. Why do I almost want to put this one on my lips? Like just. Then we have the more champagne shade, which is funny because that champagne shade is actually thicker in consistency than all of the rest. So they all have a different kind of a touch to them. I'm gonna zoom you guys in and I'm gonna apply one on my eyes, one on my lips, and then I'll just take you with me throughout my day and we'll vlog a little, do some check-ins and see how this new product from Dior for your eyes and your lips wears. We're gonna go in with the shade 548 and I'm gonna take this on my fingertip first and kind of like, while it's still wet, work off the back of my hand and just pray for the best. So I'm gonna pop this on top of my lips. Ooh. I really like that. Boy, it does dry down super fast though. So you gotta like have some hustle when you are putting this on. I think for the eyes, what I'm gonna do is play a little bit with this darker kind of chocolate brown. And I just wanna see how this lays on top of the outer corner where I have some darker brown laid down already. This is actually very opaque and pretty easy to blend, surprisingly. All right, now I wanna take the copper shade and just put that in the inner corner to kind of tie the look together, even though it's not gonna look the same because obviously I had red lipstick on, but it'll still tie a little bit of that warmth together. And I think it might look really pretty. It's nice that you can actually blend on top because sometimes cream shadows, the second you go in with a brush and powder and blend through the crease, it kind of just destroys the look altogether. Not bad. The other thing I want to show you guys is like, this is not going anywhere. Like it is the weirdest thing, how it just like dries down so, so fast. I feel like I'm gonna have a really hard time getting all of this off the back of my hand. But of course, the good news with that is that it seems like this is gonna stay on my face for a really long time. So I am going to put on a little liner and lash and then pull the camera back out and we will regroup. I am absolutely die hard loving how this looks right now and how it feels. 
I did not think that I would like it so much on my lips, but you guys, like, it feels like nothing. It feels like powder. It doesn't feel drying like a lot of metallic lip products because you guys know I even tried out Tom Ford metallic lipsticks, which are like $50 a piece about a year ago and I hated them. I thought that they made my lips look really wrinkly and weird and it was drying and it felt gritty. This feels really comfortable and I love that I have the same shade on my mouth as I do the inner corner right here. It's set really, really fast. It's not a sparkly metallic. It's more of a kind of diluted metallic, which I'm actually enjoying. It doesn't look crazy. It just looks like a little bit of shine. And I'm curious to see how much wear time I can get out of this product. For 25 bucks, I think you get a lot of product in that tube. And I'm actually more excited now that I'm wearing this than I was before even trying it. I don't know why I thought this just wouldn't work, but I am surprised. So right now I'm gonna go run some errands, take you with me, do the huge, and we'll do some close-ups and check-ins and I will see you guys in a little bit. All right, you guys, first off, this makeup is wearing beautifully. I just ate a protein bar where it like crumbles on your mouth and usually destroys any type of a lip look that I'm wearing. But this is just like, it's staying put nicely. I like it. And the eyeshadow has not creased. It is wearing really well. We're in the car, obviously. Um, but it's an exciting drive because I'm getting a new car and I have not ever in my life been so excited for a car you guys I'm not normally the type of person to be like let me show off all of my stuff that I have like that's not my thing everybody has their own thing that they like doing and I almost get weird about it usually it's just I don't I don't know why do I get weird about it I, don't know. I just get weird about it but I'm surprised you're even talking about it I know but I think that I don't, this is a huge moment and I just want to share it with you guys because I'm really really excited about this and I happen to be doing a wear test of makeup, so it's one of my errands. It's the most exciting errand I've had in a long time. So um, I'm capturing it and we're on our way to get my new car. The clouds look really beautiful right now. You guys! A bajillion hours later because it felt like we were at the car dealership forever and ever and ever and I wasn't gonna like bust out the camera and be like look at my eyeshadow it's worn <laughs> for two hours more exactly like I was trying to just like you know be an adult so we're in my new car I drove it home James wanted to drive it um, to Target that's where we're at I'm wait do it again do it again ready one two I got a Porsche Macan, you guys. This car is beautiful. I just, I love it so much. I'm so excited. And before you guys give me crap of like, well, does she even have a driver's license? Tati doesn't drive. James is her chauffeur. Does he even work? Does he even work? <laughs> <laughs> yes. She doesn't vlog and drive. No, I don't. I don't. But I enjoy driving and this is just such a dream come true. This car is so beautiful, you guys. The interior is like chocolate brown. I'm gonna give you like a quick little tour. I'm not gonna be like super obnoxious and then we'll get back to the makeup. Oh my God, she's beautiful. Ignore the Target cart in front of us. We are not at like an elegant location. We're at Target. Look at this. Oh my God, wait, is that focusing? Can we see the stitch work? Wait, turn on the light. Look, there's a moon roof. Oh my God, there's so many buttons. Am I in a car or a spaceship? I don't know. Someone put a Pellegrino <laughs> in here. This is like heaven. Let's go inside Target and I can show you in better lighting exactly what happened with the makeup. Clearly the lipstick just did not last. Um, it is not greasy food proof, so the metallic stuff kind of really gets blotchy, but the eyes, are still doing really good. Stop. Bullseye. Do I look sexy in my outfit of the day? I look like I'm so ready to do target shot with my Uggs. A lipstick case. Three in one mascara. I never do this, Taki. Oh my God. I'm sorry. No, you're but I fine. absolutely love you. I just met a subscriber and she was so nice. You guys, when people give me hugs and like 
let me know that they watch my channel and they love my recommendations, that it means something to them. It just, it makes my whole day. Like, it's never a bother. Like, I don't care if you see me, like, in my Uggs and no makeup, whatever. Like, I love it when you guys come up to me. Love it. Love it. That looks good. Doesn't this look amazing? I think it looks really good. James is shaking his head, but I'm going to prove you wrong. Okay. How much is this? $4.99? $6.99? $4.99. Why am I yelling? Yes. You have a problem. No, this is my career. I have a channel where I review things. It's for work only. I, yeah. It's you're, not for pleasure. You're addicted to makeup. <laughs> it's not for pleasure. Can you sit pretty? Can you sit pretty? Hi. Did you miss me? I came home and realized that I did not do a close-up zoom of my eye eye makeup in Target. I got too distracted by more makeup. So I'm here now, I'm already in my pajamas, and I want to do a final check-in and let you guys know that I'm super impressed with how this wore. You know, on the lips, of course, it's going to wear off because you're eating, you're drinking, but it is really easy to reapply if you want to pop on a lipstick and just put a little more of the metallic kind of a thing on top of it. It's super easy dries down so fast and does wear a really long time unless you like touch it or mess up with you know eating greasy food like I did tonight <laughs> um yeah and then the eyes look at this it's still so nice like I have to say that this has worn without creasing crumbling um all day like all day and I was actually rubbing my eye pretty hard earlier because I felt like my eyelash was aggressively stabbing the inner corner of my eye. I actually tweeted that and I was just like, oh my gosh, I feel violated by my false lashes. Um, so I was kind of like picking at it and rubbing at it and I was surprised that a lot of this makeup still hung out and is looking as nice as it is. Like really, look, it's not bad. All in all, I'm really happy with my purchase. I like it, 25 bucks, you get a lot of product, little goes a long way. A plus from me, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for taking along with me. It's been just such a fun, wonderful, memorable day for me, so I'm happy that I got to, you know, vlog and make a video today. So yeah, all right, I'm calling it, I'm going to bed. I love you guys, and I will see you all in tomorrow's video. Mwah.